Hey guys, welcome to Medicine Medicine. Today we are up with another tutorial video on the segment of plant irritant poisons, presenting the topic Croton Thiglium. Have you seen this plant somewhere in your surrounding? If yes, then congratulations, this is what a Croton Thiglium plant looks like. It also belongs to family of Euphobiaceae, just like our resinous communis that we discussed in our earlier video. These are the seeds of Croton Thiglium plant, oval, and dark brown with longitudinal lines, but not to be confused with seeds of Ricinus communis. I guess those were much attractive than this one. If you are thinking if the entire plant of Croton Tiglium is poisonous, then don't be confused. Only the seeds and oil extracted are poisonous. Let's see what are the active principles that make the seed and oil of Croton Tiglium poisonous. These are A. Crotin. A toxalbumin, like the one present in Ricinus communis. B. Crotonocyte, a glycoside less poisonous than crotine. C. Crotonolic acid and D. Methylcrotonic acid. Out of this, crotine and crotonocyte are present in seed, whereas crotonolic acid and methylcrotonic acid are present in oil. The fatal dose for Croton Tiglium is about 4 to 5 per seeds and 1 to 2 ml of oil, whereas the fatal period is about 6 hours to 3 days. We have discussed about fatal dose and fatal period in earlier video of Ricinus communis regarding their description. So, what are the signs and symptoms of Croton poisoning? Just like I mentioned in earlier video of Ricinus communis, any irritant poison would present with burning pain in mouth to abdomen, presenting the tract to which it has passed. And other signs and symptoms include salivation, vomiting, purging, vertigo, collapse and death. And when this oil is applied to skin, it produces burning, redness and vesication over the skin. Let's see what are the post-mortem appearances in any person who has died of croton poisoning. There would be congestion, inflammation and erosion of mucosa of stomach and intestine, as well as there would be congestion of other internal organs. It is to be noted that such kind of condition is presented as post-mortem appearances in almost all kinds of irritant poisoning. Did you know that? Croton is also known as Jamal Gota in Hindi and its seeds have purgative properties because of which these seeds were used in ancient days in Ayurvedic to treat patients suffering from constipation. The fact that its seeds contain purgative properties explains why croton poisoning presents with excessive purging. So, what's the medical legal importance of croton poisoning? It could be accidental poisoning resulting from swallowing croton oil by mistake, mostly seen in case of children or when taken in large doses as purgative. It could be rarely homicidal or suicidal poisoning. The roots and oil can be used as abortifacient, whereas the oil is used as arrow poison since oil of croton tiglium can produce external irritation, vesication and swelling. This marks the end of our tutorial video. We hope we could help you a bit. If you have any queries or suggestions, drop them in comment section below. Please like, share and subscribe. Keep loving, keep supporting. See you soon with another tutorial video. Thank you guys.